I'm joined now by the incredibly talented Alex McAleer of Champions of Magic. It's a very impressive show. Alex, can you tell me a little bit about it? Uh, so Champions of Magic is, uh, there's five of us in the show, five British magicians, uh, but we all have our own sort of speciality, our own genre. Very cool. So for somebody who's maybe not that into magic, because obviously it's an easy sell to them, how about somebody who's on the fence? Why should they come check out the show? Uh, well, I think if you've never seen magic live, it's always worth seeing it live. If you've only ever seen it, you know, on TV, David Blaine, Chris Angel, that sort of thing, where you're not really sure, mm, is that real? Is this kind of camera trickery? Come see it live because you'll, there's no sort of denying your own eyes. And also there's a lot of sort of humor in the show. There's a lot of spectacle, big stadium lighting. We've got pyrotechnics, we've got you know, confetti cannons. It's, a, it's a, a really vivid experience to come see this show. All right, Alex, now you're a mind reader. I am. I'm gonna put you to the test. You got something for me here? Uh, Prove to me that you can read minds. Uh, okay. I don't know if you wanna get inside this I'm, one. Well, I was, <laughs> I was feeling that too. So uh, let's, try, uh, let's try something nice and simple. So in the show, I have a, a little section where I explain why you should never play cards with a mind reader, uh, which is partly an excuse to show off, but it does <laughs> count towards my community service. So, uh, do you play cards at all? Or? I play some blackjack. That's about the extent of my okay, card playing Okay, good. Skill. So you know the names of the suits and the values. Absolutely. Good. So I have a pack of 52 cards, but uh, one of them I've taken out and put it back in so it's upside down, buried in the pack. You're going to read my mind, and you're going to guess what that card is. Uh, Queen of Hearts. Well, I say, well, I say guess. Because that's a 1 in 52 chance. And, you know, 90% of the time, people say Queen of Hearts. If they don't say Queen of Hearts, they say Ace of Spades. So I never choose those cards. So uh, let's break it down. I'll make it easier for you. So uh, it can either be a red or a black card. So just choose a color to begin with. Don't tell you. Red or black. And you can say it out loud, but red or black, what do you want it to be? Black. Black. Happy with that, or do you want to change your mind? I'm good. Good. So black can be a I'm club. I'm never going back. <laughs> uh, it could be a club or a spade. What, what do you think uh, it is? I'll be a club. Club. OK. So get the something of clubs in mind. Don't say what it is just yet. Did you have one in mind? I do. Good. I believe you. That's good. <laughs> so, um, okay, just trust me. Keep it a club. Yeah, keep it a club, but change the value. Change it to a different club. Okay. Good. It's changed. Good. I, no, I believe you. Uh, we'll go with that one. Nervous. We'll go with that one, mainly because I can't just keep asking you to change your mind. So, uh, what did you go for in the end? Do I tell you now? Yes, please. A black club nine. Nine. Okay. Out of interest, what was the first uh, club that you had in Six. mind? Six of clubs, okay. So if that's not the nine, that is my fault, because I got you to change your mind. Take a look. Show the camera. Are you serious? <laughs> How? Alex, I want answers. How did you do this? I'll tell you later, and then we'll go. Is there a casino in Chicago? Is that right? <laughs> yeah, let's get out here and go gambling. Let's go. Let's go. I mean, impressive stuff. I'm about to figure this out. I'll tell you what, I, I stayed up all night trying to figure out how he pulled out. <laughs> he pulled a few other ones. You got to check those out. Uh, we have those extras. You can find those online. Pretty impressive stuff with Champions of Magic. So check it out for yourself. Head to championsofmagic.co.uk and to check out more mind reading from Alex, you can head to thejamtvshow.com for more mind reading tricks. It was pretty impressive stuff.